Hi there, it's Mark Sebastian, the founder of Option Pit, and this is the Ball Report Reminder. This is for education purpose only. Options should this should not be considered investment advice. This is for educational purposes only. Consult a professional if you have questions. Hey, night. Um, optionpit.com slash weekly today. Nice little trade. To come and come and uh, come and register. Uh, it's a nice, uh, it's a nice little thing to sign up for. I'm going to teach you about weeklies and daily options. Uh, if you haven't studied them, give them a look see. Speaking of giving a look see, um, the market is strong today. You know they've tried to sell it a couple times this morning. You know we're kind of back to where kind of mo we were most of the day yesterday. Um, but I want to point out how strong the Russell 2000 is. It is up huge. Now remember our rule, when the Russell is the leader, that tends to mean the market's going to keep running. So I like the market to continue to rally as long as the Russell stays strong. I like the VIX to stay around 20, potentially even lower. Um, I like the um, NDX and the SP. I mean, we're kind of up across the board. Now obviously, NDX had a huge day yesterday. And we've got some big earnings tonight, right? Apple reports tonight. Uh, we're going to spend a little time looking at Apple and what to expect out of that. Um, we're going to look at um, XOM and CVX today. They both have earnings tomorrow morning. So that'll be a fun uh, couple of things we can look at. Um, and then we're going to look at kind of the mover and shakers today. There's a lot of stocks moving and running around. Um, all the ETFs continue to look kind of interesting and fun to trade. Uh, and, you know, vol continues to soften but not tank. Um, watch VVIX. It's down to about 100. When that breaks 100, that tends to be a sign that, that vol, and in, in, in by that I mean the VIX, is going to maybe potentially collapse. Looking at the individual ETFs, you can see they're all up, all of them. Uh, the strongest being uh, consumer products, building materials, and biotech. Uh, a little strength out of the industrials and energy as well. And really, about the only one that's kind of soft is XLK. And you can kind of see that in the NASDAQ, which is soft today. But, you know, it had such a strong day yesterday. I'm not surprised that the NASDAQ is soft. Um Facebook is off a little bit today. Had a great day yesterday. We had a couple of trades that were awesome yesterday. Um, Netflix and Microsoft is kind of flattish. Uh, Netflix is up a little bit. You know, the, the, net, the big tech gave away a little bit at the end of the day yesterday. Uh, not surprisingly. Again, Apple has earnings today. Um, if Apple earnings are good, it, it, you tomorrow could be another – Bust up day could be a huge up day. Um, you know, we've played around with GE. There's been some fun trades there where we may continue to have some funness there. Um, so that's kind of everything I'm looking at today and going to be watching. Um, obviously, we'll run a couple scans, see if we can find some other things. But this is kind of how we're set up right now. All right, people, I hope you have a great day and I'll talk to you soon.